everyone this is Shivadi I hope you all are doing really good guys in this video I'll be showcasing you how you can optimize processing of your backtest and how this feature called as parallel processing comes into picture parallel processing is only suggested in case of backtest which is expected to run for more than 10 minutes and you have good computer back in so being a secure backtesting application it analyzes and process the backtested results locally onto your premises so in this case let's say if you are running a back test of let's say five days just five days which might not supersede 10 minutes of time so in that case you can use 1p as your parallel processing okay but let's say if you are doing a back test of uh, two to four years and multiple portfolios with the diversified conditions so in that case, you can understand that it's going to su supersede more than 10 minutes of time, right? So in that case, when parallel processing comes in handy, there's a slight understanding required for you to use parallel processing to its fullest extent. Let's say if you have PC with i5 4 core 8 GB of RAM, which is a standard these days, right? So you can easily run 4P of parallel processing and let's say you exceed with ram and your processors also increases so then you can even exceed your parallel processing now for instance your pc is not supporting parallel processing then whatever is the maximum limit by default back in will will run that amount of parallel processing now what it uh, does is Let's say, for example, if backtest for one year and you have defined 4PP, okay? 4PP means 4 parallel process. So, what it's going to do is it will split across 4 windows, okay? I'm just naming it as, let's say, Niyati and with 4P parallel processing, okay? Just click OK. So as you can see that it has a split across your test logically and into the four windows and it will try to process all the steps parallel to save time. You may select parallel count as per your PC configuration. For each count, ensure for 2 GB RAM and 1 core thread of CPU. For example, if you have 4 core i5 with 8 GB RAM, then you can easily run 4 parallel processes, that is 4P. Or for Two core CPU with 4 GB RAM, you can set up to two parallel, that is 2P, right? So as you can see that uh, I ran a backtest of four years from 2019 to 2023 with 4P as my parallel processing, right? So what it's going to do is it will split across four windows, as you can see, these four windows. So one do, uh, window will do one process, another window will do another process, third window will do another process, and last window will do another process and then it will consolidate result now the advantage is that these four parallel processing are running simultaneously so it saves a lot of time for you to get back test result so that's wherein parallel process comes in handy specifically when you are going for a longer run back test and with multiple number of portfolios so i hope this stands clear don't forget to smash like button for this amazing feature of Pakinzo. Stay tuned. Bye-bye. Happy back testing with Pakinzo.